All right, guys. So today we're gonna be reacting to another Mori set. Uh, Miss you like crazy. I think this was in the same casino that we reacted last time, and well, I'm very excited to react to her. Last song was very nice. Uh, some of y'all were explaining um, the piano was already. Oh my bad. Was already a backtrack. That's why you know I was like, oh, what's going on? Right. Remember, guys. I come from the classical music world, so I'm always thinking about performance, live performance. And yeah, there's people that use backtracks and stuff like that, but I'm just coming from that perspective, right? Everything acoustic, everything natural sound, all that stuff, right? I'm not saying it's better. It's not better. It's not even worse. It's just it is what it is. But we're going to react to Morissette Amon. So it's going to be Miss You Like Crazy. Same results, same casino. The musicians are looking good. They're dressed, they're dressed up very nice. They're using Roland, which is a great keyboard. Right, and Maurice is looking amazing as well. Make sure you like to subscribe. Also, for donation, description down below, you can just hit the super chat. Let's jump in. That's a nice microphone though. Great voice. She had that 90s voice, man. Oh, okay. I hear you. See, she had that 90s voice, right? Late 80s. Oh. Good, good, good. Wow. I like to see the guitar player. Yep. Oh. I'm wondering what is going on in her mind when she does that. You know what I'm saying? She's going like little. I'm wondering. Yo, that dude looks like, like Marcelito. Marcelito playing the <laughs> the bass. Day four, bam. Uh huh. Oh, that's the guitar player, not a bass player. He has some Marcelito thing going on.
That's nice. Beautiful. Can go wrong though. Mm. Let's go. Let's go. The, the crowd is into it. Yeah, beautiful. Beautiful, bravo. Bravo, bravo, bravo. My goodness, bravo, man. Hold up, hold up. What y'all doing, man? It's messing me up. There you go, beautiful, man. Oh my god, beautiful. She had this great voice. It reminds me of that 90s boy kind of thing. Beautiful, strong, uh, but sensual. sensual. But classy, you know what I'm saying? Like that kind of voice that resonates so good. And most importantly, and let me say this: I love opera. I love opera, especially Puccini. Puccini opera, I love it. The way she can go up and down very easy with flexibility. Remember, these are the classical music and and pop music. Let's put it pop music, right? That's contemporary music. They require different techniques. You have more chess boy here, but of course you're going to require more of that head voice as much as you go high, right? You cannot go chess boy and throw when you go higher. You have to go back to your head voice. But she's very well rounded when it comes down to that flexibility, right? Beautiful song. You cannot go wrong with this. That was beautiful, man. Hey, shout out to the guitar player. Shout out to the uh, man. My bad. I know. I know you're not a. It was not a bass player. It was a guitar player. He he has a Marcelito thing going on. So you know he looks very nice and you know clean and nice, man. I had to give it that. But overall, great, beautiful performance. I mean, and the fact that the audience was connected with her. You see how the audience responded during that silent. Right, that's important. That means that the uh, the audience is engaged. You see what I'm coming from with this? The audience is engaged. That is important. <sighs> Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Make sure you recommend any song in the description down below. I mean the comment section. And I will see you in the next one. I'm out. Peace.